Well, I was kind of pissy for a little while, because I was late to the game in knowing that Google is getting rid of Hangouts on Air tomorrow. And, you know, I've seen so many great streams of Hangouts on Air, people having reasonable conversation. Obviously, there's some that aren't so reasonable, but, you know, I've seen a lot of very reasonable conversations there. It's not like the kind of culture you find on Discord. Discord is mostly, I mean, not all, but mostly about trolling culture. Or gaming bros culture, you know? And, uh, you know, if that, if, if, <laughs> if the only alternative to, uh, Hangouts on Air was, uh, Discord, I was just going to be so disappointed. Of course, people can also use Skype, do Skype conversations and use OBS to stream to, to you know, to YouTube doing a, a live stream that way. But that's kind of a pain. But there's, there's this new, there's a, I don't know how new exactly it is, but there's, there's an alternative called StreamYard. And uh, it looks promising. Um, you have to look at the little StreamYard logo there when if you don't pay money to have, you know, your server. But that's fine. Um, at least there's something out there that has most of the same kinds of options you found at Hangouts on Air. So, that's good. Um, man, do I... Oh, when I thought it was going to have to be Discord, I was just so disappointed. I can't stand that program. I can't stand Discord. It's such bloatware. Its layout is terrible. Its layout is al is almost as bad as Blender. You know, just things are not in places where they should be. You know, oh, to, to adjust your settings, go to the bottom area right next to your icon near the bottom. Click the gear icon there. Then you get some options there. Okay, fine. But there's no... Just things are not where you'd expect them to be, you know? Now, that's not necessarily bad at, at all times. I mean, sometimes the places where we get used to them being aren't that great of places either. We're just used to it, right? But uh, Discord, man, it's so bloated. It takes like 30 seconds to load. You, at first, you, you first load it up, and it'll put up a little window with a little spinning joystick-looking thing. <laughs> Do, does that for a while, then it closes that, opens another one, and does it some more. Then it opens a gray screen, a dark gray screen, for about 10 seconds. And then you finally get to the home screen that has video ads playing. Yeah, lovely. Bloatware. Bloatware. Can't stand Discord. Just can't stand it. But uh, at least that's not... Uh, at least that's not the only alternative. And, you know, I haven't seen people do actual video chat hangouts... Uh, that they that they stream on Discord. It's always just the audio, where people can be as anonymous as they want, other than their voice. But uh, I don't know. I I'm wondering how many people are going to bother with uh, using some using a new service like Streamyard, or whether people are just going to stop having. Uh, online hangouts. Ha stop having uh, streamed hangouts. You know? It's just, it's another end of an era, you know? Hopefully, though, hopefully people will, will move on to other software, other methods of streaming, and we'll still have the decent conversations. But that is yet to be seen. So, anyway... <laughs>